So as someone who is currently holding a position on tectonic takers and miltonic, as someone who is bullish and optimistic about the long-term success of tonic, I still have to acknowledge that tectonic is in many ways kind of crazy guys and it does also come at a high form of risk. With that being said, there are very, 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 very bullish price targets for tectonic and they actually just got even higher throughout these last couple of days. So I want to go ahead and share these bullish price targets and also we're going to go ahead and cover most importantly, how much of a risk tectonic currently presents. For those of you that are currently holding a position on tectonic or are considering adding more or simply entering a new position, we're going to keep it short and sweet here. If this is your first time on the channel, do me a favor like the video. It helps reach more people and subscribe to the channel for more updates on tonic and also guys, if you want 12 absolutely free. Hawksworth. All the way up to $30,000. Use that link down below, sign up for Weevil. Deposit just $1 onto the platform and you're going to get 12 totally free stocks worth all the way up to $30,000. Guys, let's go ahead and get right to it. Check this out. What I really like that Tectonic has managed to do here throughout these last 24 hours is that we have seen an increase in volume or volume is up by 56%. Very, very positive news year. Total trading volumes is at $495,000. Now many of you might be like, well, other projects are within the billions. Our volume is so, so low. Keep in mind guys, keep in mind Tectonic is only available on one major exchange. That would be of course Crypto.com. So the fact that we have this much Tectonic circulating, when we're only available on one major exchange, is actually a very, very positive sign and also we're doing a decent job of holding kind of strong here. You know, we're not necessarily plummeting or anything like that. Where we're not rocketing, we're not going to the moon, where we're flat, we're basically flat. We're up 0.89% as of the minute that I'm filming this video. But why I'm saying that you know, we're a decent shape here is that we're holding steady during a day when the entire market is pulling back here and kind of substantially guys the overall market down 2% Bitcoin at 19,000. Ethereum. At 1500 here Cardano one of my favorite projects at 47 cents massive by the dip opportunity with Cardano down a little bit over 4%. Again, you can see red, red, red all over the area right here and again. Tectonic or it's not exciting, right? It's not exciting, but we're holding steady here. We're doing a good job of holding steady the entire Kronos blockchain. We cannot say the same thing about the entire Kronos blockchain is now a little bit over 4%, right down a little bit over 4%. I'm also bullish on. Maybe as finance, Tectonic and of course the Lord itself Crypto.com now in terms of how much of a risk is involved with Tectonic right because many, many of you might have commented that maybe I'm too bullish, that I'm, I'm being too optimistic, that I only cover the positive aspects. But I don't think you've been watching these videos correctly or maybe you didn't hear me correctly or whatever, right? The point is, I have always emphasized that at this point, guys, Tectonic is a business during its early stages. You almost have to think of it as Tectonic coming to you and asking you, hey, do you want to buy into the business right now? The one benefit that you get for buying right now is that you get to buy in very cheap, right? Like any other business. Apple, Google, Amazon, whatever, Netflix, that were all cheap right at the beginning, right? During the early days, Tectonic is coming to you and saying, hey, do you want to buy into the business? During the early days, you get to buy at a massive discount. However, what you are giving up in exchange, right, for buying at a discount is that you're taking in a higher form of risk because any business during its early days. To fail, right? Any business during its early days can fail, and I acknowledge that. But what makes Tectonic so attractive, and why I am personally willing to take that risk, is the following information right here. If Tectonic had unit swaps market cap of 4.5 billion, one tonic would be worth 0.0000045, an upside of 343x, an upside of 343x is what Tectonic currently presents if it was to reach the same market cap of unit swap. 
Why are we comparing tectonic to unit swap? They're both in the decentralized finance space. And of course Tectonic, like any other business, wants to get to the same level of the higher you know. Of the high players within its industry, and in this case today, Uniswap is simply the top dog within the DeFi space, right? So Tectonic wants to get to that level. And I'm not saying that this is going to happen tomorrow. I'm not saying that this is going to happen next week or next month, whatever. This is going to take time and you have to feel comfortable with, you know, seeing pullbacks, because we also have to be honest here throughout these last what is it, you know, 7 days or a month now. You don't need to be a technical analysis wizard to see that. You know, quite simply we've been pulling back right from here to here, we've been pulling back, right? So you have to feel comfortable with that. It just as you're excited about the 343x, you have to feel comfortable with you know, periods of time where we may be pulling back. So first off, you don't need to load the boat and also number two here and I think most importantly is I'm very realistic. I am very realistic and this applies to me as well. I'm not saying, and I don't expect anyone here to buy right now or wherever it is that they already bought, right? See a 343x rise and sell at the very top? Because look at me, I'm super cool and I'm super smart, right? Of course not. It does not work that way. The perfect trait does not exist, but. With that being said, with that being said, imagine that you were able to capture just 10%. One tenth of this bullish price target. That is a 30 extra return on your investment. As someone who invests in both the stock market and the crypto market, that's unheard of. That's crazy, right? That's crazy. But again, just 10% being very, very, and if you want to take it a step beyond that. If you want to take it a step beyond that and say, you know what, I just want to capture 5% of this. I just want to capture 5% of this bullish price target. You're looking at a 15x return on your investment. And and this is just kind of scratching the surface here, right? 5% of the total outlook and I'm locking in 15x. So this is why I feel comfortable taking in the risk that comes with Tectonic and if buying during its early days, right, of buying during its its early stages here while it's still developing. Again I'm, I'm not here to say load the boat, I'm you know, it's all pretty right. There's a risk involved like anything else and for this moment Tectonic presents a high form of risk, but it also presents a high potential for profit. So I think the ideal setup would be to go in with the light position, right? You don't need to go in super heavy, especially when the potential upside is so, so high. And it's not like I'm just going into this as a gamble, right, because I'm bringing brought in here by this high price target. But I do believe fundamentally Tectonic can succeed. And I like the fact that it forms a part of the Kronos blockchain, which has a very strong community behind it, right? I'm behind Crypto.com, I'm behind VS Finance. I like all these projects. That's also mainly really why I'm invested. Get on top of that. If it if it has a very, very bullish price target, then of course, why not, right? So keep that in mind, right? Manage your risk accordingly. If you guys want more updates on Tectonic, like the video, subscribe to the channel. Thank you all so much for watching.